Hi you guys, I'm Jazzy and I'm back with another video. So today I am doing a video, uh, unboxing video on my new thermal printer. Um, this printer will be used to help me print shipping labels and stuff for my packages that I send off for my customers. Some of you may know, some of you may not know, I have my own body butter business. Um, it's called Emory's Essentials. I sell through Etsy. Um, I'll put the link down here below in the description box. So definitely take a look at um, our products. We have an amazing sale going on right now. So stay tuned to this unboxing video. So this is the printer in here. What I will do, I will put the link for the printer in the description as well. Um, these printers can range from $60 all the way up to $300. Um, the price I paid for this one was about $79. It was on sale during Black Friday, so I got it there. Um, so let's take a look. So on my order from Amazon, um, I ordered a digital scale, a postage digital scale. This is about $20. I'll put the link also in the description as well as labels. The labels I, um, I ordered this time were actually the fold labels, not the roll labels. I said I'll test these out first, see if I like them or not, and then I'll go to the fold label, I mean to the roll labels. So I decided to get, like I said, the shipping scale as well as label printer due to the fact that I have a lot of orders going in and out and it will help me with the shipping process instead of me having to keep running back and forth to the post office. So in the box comes a plain box, um, plain, plain box. As you see, give some type of instructions here, how to get a thousand labels. Definitely will do that review, so we can get that. Okay, so in the box, it comes with a shipping. Let's say if I have to send it back to the company, it gives me the shipping labels. I want to return it or not. It also comes with some instructions in here. Inside the main box, oops, it has another small box here and I believe this box is just like the stand and one cool thing about this printer itself is it came with the printer label shelf a lot of them does do not come with that shelf so that's why I bought purchased this one because to me I felt like it was a steal because it was like $80 it come with the shelf itself so I was like hey why not try it out okay and we also here, it looks like these may possibly be the cords, you know, the power cords and all that good jazz. And then we also have some more cords inside. We have the DVD that goes into your computer and also the driver instructions right here. This is the printer itself. As you can see, it's very small and very compact. That's exactly what I need because I'm in the process of getting my office together at home. So perfect, perfect. Then I also come with this USB. This is what you use to plug into your laptop or your desktop computer to get the um, program installed so you can start printing your label. Now, if you're thinking of the name of this printer, I'll just drop the link below because this is really a no-name printer. Um, but we will see what it do. Very compact. So I'm going to put it together really quick.
simple. Let the cords up there. And once it reads the label, it basically makes that noise as you heard. So what we're about to do is it get the driver installed to my work. So you have two options to do it. You go through the driver or go through the website. the driver so we on my windows computer so i'm going through the windows driver select your language all right that's already done we already have it plugged in the power is on as you see in the one part of the video we just continue the installation process printer is installed so once the printer is installed the next thing you want to do is test out your printer label so what we're going to do we're going to click test label we're going to hit print make sure you select the printer and print and let's see See, we have it here, and it looks like I have installed it upside down. So we're gonna adjust that part, rip that part off, pull this out in the back, and flip this paper upside down. So you want the basically the paper to be insert in sticker side up sticker side up all right let's test it again and there we go there are our printer labels so this is a test we see that it works let's get the shipping started as far as shipping today i will be using the regular post office usps um all the information is basically self-explanatory you just put all the information you need in the system you click finish and pay then you hit accept and continue and then you'll see that it'll start processing your label on the next screen you basically will say how you want it to print if you want a receipt or not i don't print with a receipt because they're going to email you one anyway and then you just select it and then you select your label and then you could hit print you could also schedule a pickup and here it is now sometimes you have to come in here and adjust the size so it can print properly so we're gonna try it again perfect Thank you for watching my video today. I hope it was helpful. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you.